On Tuesday, the U.S. dollar was under pressure while U.S. equities were left consolidating Monday declines that saw the S&P 500 sinking to a yearly low below the previous low from February. German IFO data was shrugged off and most of the activity for the day was attributed to pre-event risk positioning ahead of tomorrow's anticipated Fed decision. There has been a growing pressure on the Fed to reconsider what had been a more aggressive outlook for rate hikes in 2019, and while it won't be because of any pressure from the White House, the Fed has been signaling through scattered speak in recent weeks that it could be moving in that direction. It's worth noting oil-correlated currencies have had a tougher go of late with the Canadian dollar tracking just off a 2018 low against the buck. That's a just off the dollar CAD 2018 high, despite the broader downside pressure on the buck. Oil has been in collapse mode since October after it was looking quite strong, rallying to its highest level since 2014. Looking to Wednesday, the as already highlighted Fed decision will be the big event risk of the day. Ahead of that, key standouts come from German producer prices, UK producer prices and consumer prices, Eurozone construction output, UK CBI trends, Canada CPI and US existing home sales. That's all for now.